What is up, y'all? Welcome, Power One. Peace, love, and life. Give a big bro to you all. I missed you all, lovely. Welcome back. Okay, I got a couple of the messages for y'all. So, first of all, y'all song is Kim, K E M, Love Calls. Um, I was listening to that song, and in that song, he started off when your heart broke, and you know, your girl about to go in, but when your mind is made up. When your heart has other plans, something like that, and then a beat come in. Well, you know, well, I say the beat, but it's more like the um the piano or the violin, that bass. When love's calling your name, that song. So some of you guys, somebody is heartbroken here, and some of y'all, you could be heartbroken. Some of y'all, this could be like somebody could want to fix something, and you may still have feelings for this person. And it's like you have your mind made up on this person, but when they come back in, you could kind of like fold. Some of you guys, you may not be standing on business. That's what I'm getting here. This could be somebody where they're not standing on business. That's one of the messages I'm getting here. We're going to get into that, okay? But somebody around here is peace ain't standing on business here. But there's still love there, you know? So we 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 go get into that. Others of you guys, I also heard, um, I love it when you call me Big Papa, put your hands in the air if you a true player, right? But why I thought that, don't shoot the message, okay? Because I know you like the Rocky Glock. But why I thought that that was Tupac? It actually was not Tupac. It actually was uh, Biggie. Now, I listen to Biggie. I've heard that song plenty of times, but I always thought that was Tupac. I don't know why. I always thought that line from the song was Tupac. It was actually Biggie right so for some of y'all it makes me th put your hands in the air if you a true player some of you guys somebody is not this this is just intuitive message there could just be a situation where somebody is not really the true player maybe you're the true player that's what i'm getting here because i'm like okay i thought that was this person but i find out it's not this person it's actually this person and then it's like put your hands in the air if you a true player some of y'all there could be somebody trying to celebrate or ravish or do something offer your stuff like this could be somebody that's feel like they're on top but it's not even your stuff. That's just what I'm... I'm not even their stuff. That's what I'm getting here. So, we gonna get into that. But that's just... I hope y'all can understand that. Because I don't even know what's going on. Like, I'm just getting some Twitter messages. I'm just letting y'all know. So, even I don't even know what's going on like that. So, I got to get into these messages. But, yeah. So, that's what y'all need to know. Let's see. I want to get into this love call. We gonna call it the love call. Because clearly, some, some of y'all, this person could want to call you. Somebody wants to call you. Or some of y'all, you may block somebody and block and They could be calling somebody wants to call you you know they want to have a conversation with you we got the ace of cups somebody has emotions somebody still has emotions emotions are still there very deep running very deep somebody still has feelings for somebody with this five of wands in reverse whatever the issue was that you and this person had whatever y'all was fighting over the disagreement whatever was the problem somebody wants to fix it so somebody wants to call y'all so some of y'all, this may not be y'all heartbroken, you know, it could be for some, but for some of y'all, somebody's heartbroken over you. Um, I'm hearing somebody extending on business, so this could be this person, this could be you, but somebody has emotions for somebody, somebody wants to fix whatever this is, could be a Cancer, Spicy, Scorpio, or a Leo, somebody wants to fix something here. Somebody wants to come back in. They want to um, start fresh. They want to start new. They want to um, revive something. Somebody has emotions still for someone here. With the strength card in reverse, somebody could even want to come back in to fix stuff. Somebody could have made you feel... Um, I'm getting multiple messages. This could be somebody that used your vulnerability against you for some. For some of y'all, this could be somebody um, that wasn't um, equally given to you. Others of y'all, this could even be a situation where this could be the type of person where... They could have made you have insecurities, you know. They could have brought insecurities up in you or triggered certain insecurities. That's what I'm getting here for some of you guys. Some of you this person could have made you doubt the connection or doubt what y'all had. There's something like that here. Somebody wants to come in and fix this. I'm trying to see more of what the situation is. Look at that, the two of cups here. Look at that two of cups right under the ace of cups. Somebody's had love for somebody. Somebody still wants a relationship. Somebody still wants a connection. Some of y'all with this Ace of Pentacles, this could be somebody that's coming back in that wants a connection with you. They want to be emotionally available to you. This person could be trying to come back in 
and using finances as a way like this could be somebody that's gonna come in they're gonna express themselves to you emotionally you know tell you how they feel they're gonna want to try to repair stuff and fix stuff with you and stuff like that with this ace of pentacles here this is somebody that's going to try to come in and show you that they want something long term they're going to be trying to invest in you and that could be taking you out on dates that could be um this person you know helping you out financially tangibly they're going to be doing stuff or giving you things expensive things this is somebody that's going to try to come in and they're going to try to show you that they're looking for something long term the thing is this is somebody with the strip card reverse they know that they made you feel some type of way you know with this ace of swords in reverse here for some of you guys there could be certain stuff that you still don't know about like this could be like you with somebody falling out or what i don't know what their e issue is you know for some of y'all the issues that i named could be the issues you know i'm, I'm keeping general but with this ace of swords in reverse some of y'all may still don't even have all the information of what happened like it could be like when this person come back in there's still things that y'all need to discuss because there's still things that you don't know the truth about that could be for some of y'all you still feel like you don't have the truth you still feel like there's pieces that you're missing you know Others of you guys here, you can even feel like this is somebody that you can feel like they're a liar. For some, you may feel like they're dishonest. So this is what I'm seeing here. For some of you, this can even be somebody here as well where they could, didn't even know how to communicate with you in the past. Maybe this is somebody where they did not know how to open up to you. That could have been an issue as well. We got the star card here. For some of you, the reason why somebody's come back is because they're realizing, realizing you are the star. This is somebody that's seen... So this is somebody that's seen you put pour back into yourself so this is somebody that y'all not with this is somebody that y'all have dealt with in the past in some type of shape or form they seen that you walked away from them you started pouring into yourself you look good you smell good money's right body is starting to heal everything's starting to come together for you things are falling into place for you baby and somebody sees you here and with the justice card here they want to come back in and fix stuff with you they want to come back and balance stuff out with you because we're but look at this two two of wands wherever you are going you're going somewhere positive. Like, this is this is a situation. So, somebody's heartbroken over you. Yeah, I'm hearing your mind's made up. And I'm hearing, you know, standing on, when I kept saying somebody, I'm standing on business. This could be a situation for some of you guys where, like, somebody had their mind made up about you. And they were supposed to stand on business. Or they had their mind made up about you. And some of you, no matter how long it's been, this is somebody that at one point in time, they had their mind made up this person was moving the way this person is moving as far as their actions they had their mind made up about y'all they knew how they felt about you they knew what it was gonna be what it wasn't gonna be they was okay with how things ended or what happened whatever transpired between y'all they was cool with it but this is given like once you leave you walk away they walk away from you they for sure they done with you and then they see you pouring back into yourself they see all these changes start happening to your life and how you're growing and stuff like that if somebody wants to come in and give love to you here because somebody still wants a relationship with you they still want a connection with you here and somebody wants somebody what somebody whatever the issue was in the past somebody wants to fix it here because somebody is it's almost like somebody feel like you're out of their league like this is somebody that could have had y'all and i and for some of y'all still really it's crazy because it's like as i'm telling y'all about this person i still feel like there's something that i'm missing and that's how y'all could feel like y'all could have felt like there were still pieces that was missing we're like when you end the stuff with this person there is still stuff that you knew you didn't have all the answers to. There is still stuff that you you just took what you had and seen it for face value. You're like, okay, you know what? I see that this is all I need to see, but I still don't have all the answers I want. That's what I'm getting here. And, and it's crazy because I told you on multiple things of the reason this could have ended. And it's still like I'm still missing something. That's crazy. Like, it's, it still feel like that. So with this star card here, somebody wants to fix something with you because they see who you elevated them to. A lot of you guys, you'll be getting a lot of attention. Some of y'all, you may even have something going on in the public eye, or you may be having something that's starting to pick up more views, whatever that's on. Some of y'all, if you have a business or something, something's starting to work out for you. If you have a career, something is working out for you guys. And happiness looks good on y'all. It does. And with this Ace of Pentacles here, somebody wants to come back in and try to come back in and impress you. This is somebody that feel like they have to impress you. This person feel like, I'm here all aboard. Like, this is somebody that kind of feel like, 
they got to get their ticket, you know? They got to step in line, you know what I'm saying? They got to go, I don't, what's the things where you go, like, I, th I believe they definitely in New York, like, when you go out to the train station, you got to go through the things or stuff like that. Some people kind of, like, skip through and hop over. No, it ain't none of that. It ain't none of that, okay? With this temperance here, somebody wants to balance something out after you cut them. Some of y'all, this could be somebody that cut you off. Like, this is, y'all could have cut this person off or this person cut y'all off. But somebody wants to balance something with you after cutting you off. I feel like somebody walked away from y'all. With this Ace of Swords reverse, for some of you, this could be somebody that ghosted y'all. For some of you, this could have been somebody where, like, when they walked away from you, you didn't... This can even be a situation where you and somebody dealing with each other, and then they start dealing with you, and you don't have a reason why. Like, this could be somebody that could have been dealing with somebody else, or some... That's the situation. That's the situation. It's just like... And, and this message is going to resonate with y'all differently. Some of y'all take what resonates with does. If you hear me saying your situation and stuff like that, take that part. Because I'm giving y'all multiple situations because I'm seeing multiple things. Everybody is not in the same dynamic, okay? But that's what I'm seeing here for some of y'all as well. Where there could have been like you and this person just ended out of nowhere. Or things just changed. Like one day you woke up and things just like feel like it's just like a switch. And that's because somebody has something else going on in the background. That's what I'm seeing here for some that's just what i'm seeing i'm hearing that's just how i feel a my just fucking main that's what i'm hearing y'all that's the song i'm hearing right now that's crazy for some of you, well look at the three story third party for some of you this person i don't know why i'm here i might just fucking main for some I, this is coming through but but for some of y'all this could be um a situation where if this person was dealing with someone for some of y'all you could have knew of this person for some some type of shape or form you could have knew of this person that's just for like a small few of y'all because i don't know why i'm here it might just fucking mean like somebody could like that was your yo 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 partner oh okay that's what i'm getting here that's for some that's, that's for some but with this six of sword this is y'all walking away after some type of third party situation and moving forward and ever since you move forward for somebody you've been up You've been up. And now look at that. The Knight of Cups in reverse. Now somebody, they they feel, they feel like they didn't see you who you were before. So the reason why somebody want to come back to you is because somebody feel like who you were, they ignored that. This is giving like somebody see you. You you may not be where you want to be yet. You may not have the things that you want to have. You may not even be, you not even in your full potential yet. You growing. You know, right now you just a, a caterpillar right now, okay? You ain't even get to get in your cocoon or none of that. You didn't even get to spray your wings. You just a caterpillar right now. You know, you got these colors on you. You Right now you feasting. Right now you putting that work in, getting yourself together. But when you actually get into the cocoon and then you, it's time for you to come out and you open your wings and you fly away and you just in the sunlight and you got the wings the colors everything is ready that's y'all like somebody seen y'all elevate like this is somebody that for some of y'all this is giving like a come up i don't know why I'm, this is how it feels like somebody felt like you had a come up since you walked away from them some this is like somebody somebody this is giving like i'll have to tell people i'm power one x just for me to uh get some type of attention that's what i'm getting like this is how the energy feels i don't know what y'all do but this is how somebody's looking at you they feel like since you walked away or since they walked away from you you have had a come up you have had some type of growth spur and this is not just giving it financially this is giving career rise lifestyle looks some of y'all you're not even fully there yet somebody like sees this and somebody wants to come back because and somebody wants to come, and I'm not getting that this person does not have love for you with this Ace of Cups be, or whatever. I'm not, because I do feel like this person has love for y'all, but this is somebody that fell in love with you after you, you turned into who you turned into. This is not, as soon as I'm about to get ready and say that, I don't know if y'all heard it, but I'm going to repeat it anyways, but my camera shove and say had a clear store. So this is somebody that don't want you to know that. This is somebody that loved you with conditions. This is somebody that loves you, but they love who you became. They don't love the person that you were before. And that's a hard pill to swallow for somebody to... This is... this is, And for some of y'all, I don't know why I'm getting a dynamic of Blueface and Chris Sean. Now, I'm not saying y'all are Chris Sean at all. But this is given that type of situation, you know? Where, like, you grew more without somebody. And they don't like... That. I'm not, oh, for me to say that, they probably don't like that for some. But for some of you, it's somebody that loves you with conditions. 
and seeing them see you blossom like this is a hard pill for them to swallow right now so that's that and this person wants to call you so some of y'all be expecting somebody from y'all past to get in contact with you um uh, we definitely got heavy water sign and air sign so this could definitely be some type of water or air sign we got a little bit of fire here so this could be a fire sign but just be you know somebody's going to try to get in contact with some of you guys you know um but yes let's get into this other situation so for some of you guys and we're going to end this reading soon but yeah for some of y'all somebody i don't even know what this situation is but somebody is pretending. I don't know if it's somebody that's. I don't. I don't know. It's like somebody's pretending. Like that's just all I'm getting here. Like, and I don't know. If this is somebody that took something from you guys. I don't know what it is. But we're gonna see, because we're gonna get to the bottom of it. Okay. We have stress, cleanse and detoxify from unnecessary commitments. So some of you guys here, somebody is stressed. Let me see what this says here. It says. Trade show list. Trade show list. I believe that's what I can't even see because it's dark and I got my flashlight. Okay. Yeah, trade show list. Okay. We got trade. Right here, these blue itty bitty words say trade show list. So for some of you guys here, I don't know if somebody that's trying to trade destinies because that's kind of what I heard. I don't know. Somebody's stressed out for some of you guys because just like I told you about that song. I thought it was Tupac, it was Biggie, you know, and it wasn't Tupac, it was Biggie. And then I'm here, but the part I was listening to was, if you were true, put your hands in the air, if you were true player, like somebody's not even a true player here. Like, I don't know what this necessarily is, but somebody's not a true player where it's like, somebody could be trying to take something from you and make it as theirs that's what i'm getting here and they're exhausted because they're putting in so much time and effort this person's holding on to the paper you know they look they look exhausted because something's not working out they got a coffee there so they're trying to stay energized i don't know what's going on we got the divine counterpart oh 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 well that's what this is giving for some of y'all here, this is somebody that's stressed out. And, and for some of y'all, I feel like it's this person that I was just telling y'all about. But for some of y'all, somebody stressed out here because they felt like somebody was their divine counterpart. And somebody over here putting their hands in the air like they're the true player. Way like they just don't care. And the whole time, they're not even the... I don't know I'm getting that off of um, grown nuts who like some freeze. And they freeze. And they're like, now put your hands in the air and wave it. Like somebody y'all like somebody find out that somebody's not who they thought they were and now they stressed out and for some of this could be i don't know why i'm seeing this paper as like some type of contract or some type of commitment i don't know like somebody's stressed out because they're in something that they may not be able to get out of we got divine timing Something's playing out of divine timing. So this could be somebody... I don't know if this is karma. I don't know what this is. We, I'm just going to keep pulling. We're going to see. We got dedication. Stay dedicated to your goals. Effort that will reap success. So this is somebody that thought that they're going to have something with a person. I'm about to pull tarot now. We got boundaries here. Know when to put up and let down your walls. Somebody was dedicated to overstepping some, some 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 type of boundary here. And now they're stressed out. Look at all these papers piled up in the back. Somebody is, look at that. It's like somebody's stressed out because they did something to try to take something from you. Or, or took something from you to give to someone else. And that person is not even the right person. Because some of y'all, this doesn't even have to be divine counterpart. This can talk about the right person for something, you know. We got the world card here. Some type of cycles closing out. I'm also seeing some type of success. We got the two of wands reverse. See, look at that. Somebody says so somebody cannot close out some cycle. What does the world card here in the two of wands reverse? Somebody wants to close out something that they can't. Like somebody's stuck in something that they can't close out. Now, for some of y'all, we got the tippers here because something is keeping somebody balanced. So somebody could be in something financially with another person that they can't leave. They're with somebody for financial reasons or financial assets is tied into one another. And somebody wants to close out a cycle they can't. And then 
for some of y'all here, I'm also seeing a situation where somebody, something's keeping somebody from being successful here as well. We got the foolish here. Somebody felt like they made a foolish decision here. Somebody made a decision thinking something was going to balance out for them or work out for them. Now they stuck in something that they don't want to be in. But this person could have thought they're going to have some type, of, some type of success. So somebody stressed out because somebody could have got with somebody for financial reasons. Or somebody got with someone just for tangible things. And with this divine time and the dedication, somebody could even wait. Like This is somebody that would like sit here like you ever see like the movies where like somebody would like pretend to be with somebody and love with someone and the whole time it was moving for the resources that's like what i'm getting here like the movies look at that the nine of pentacles at the bottom of the deck somebody had a lot going on for themselves so somebody seen somebody successful now somebody stuck in something that they can't get out of and some of you this could have happened to somebody that y'all was dealing with for some or for some of y'all this could be them dealing with somebody and they got caught up in the situation we got the moon card somebody was keeping secrets look at that two of wands in reverse here now somebody can't move forward somebody got so this could be a situation where somebody got with someone for financial reasons thinking they're going to be successful but little did they know somebody was keeping some type of secrets here and with the two of wands in reverse now somebody stuck this is oh wow y'all you know what i heard y'all this is this is giving one of them situations where it's like you see in the movies where like it'll be i don't know it's just giving one of them situations in a movie where it's like somebody oh what's that movie okay it's gonna be off the wall because i probably shouldn't use this movie because it's like a scary movie and it's so off the wall but y'all remember when like that i forgot what the movie called when they when the girl had got married it was like a scary movie they got married or whatever and then she had it was like a ritual or whatever they have to um basically kill the bride or whatever and stuff like that order for them to all to stay alive i don't know it was like some type of ritual or something like that and i'm not getting nothing crazy like that but i'm just getting where the plot where it was like she got married to this person and as soon as she got into the family she did not know that all of this was going on so that's what i'm getting here now so for some of y'all this could be just assets here but somebody got with someone thinking that stuff was peaches of cream and they are finding out a whole nother side of somebody. They finding out all types of stuff, things popping up, and they did not know this. They did not know somebody was keeping this, you know? And with the six of swords, if somebody wants to walk away from somebody, but with the three of pinnacles here somebody feels foolish for not working things out with y'all like yeah the three of swords this could be somebody that put you on the third i keep getting that so some of y'all somebody could have put you in a third party situation made you feel like you weren't good enough looked at this person as better than you because this person had more invested or more built some of y'all like this is giving like somebody had more going for themselves but somebody didn't care about the effort that you put in so they moved towards somebody else now they wishing they could work things out with you because they're stuck in something with someone. And some of you don't even have to be like a marriage. It could be like assets, finance, living with each other. Like somebody feel like they're stuck with somebody they don't want to be with. Now they stress out. So I don't know. That's what I'm seeing here, y'all. And then for others of y'all, somebody is trying to... Somebody could be trying to pretend like something that's yours is theirs. Let me pull cards on that. Let me... I'm going to pull some more cards on this. What is this person trying to... um? Look at that sacrifice. Somebody was trying to sacrifice you guys. Yeah, giving up something now for a future reward. Yeah, so for some of y'all here, somebody was trying to sacrifice something. I'm like, I'm getting something that you do. Like maybe I don't know. Somebody, I don't know. We gonna see. We got ask your angels here. See divine. Your angels want to support you here. This could be somebody that's watching tarot as well, or. They definitely could be into magic, but darker magic. What was this person trying to pretend and take? That was my power ones. So I just want to know. We got the Queen of Cups in reverse here. For some of y'all here, this could even be somebody that would... Okay, for some of y'all here, this is the type of person where, like, there will be... There will... I don't know why I'm here. I'm not going to say people pleaser. But for some of you, this is the type of person that would do stuff for people to get close to people. That's what I'm getting here. We got the King of Swords reverse, but they have some type of manip. All right, but yeah, so for some of you guys here, this is somebody that would do certain stuff and be nice to people to get kind of close to them with manipulated intentions. So this is somebody that was being nice to you 
or coming off caring or nice to you, but they had a hidden motive with this King of Swords in reverse. Somebody had like some type of hidden motive here. With this Seven of Cups here, somebody seen that you had like a lot of opportunities or like a lot of ideas or somebody seen that you had a lot of things that could uh turn. This is like somebody seen you have a lot of opportunities or they seen that you have some type something innovative. Somebody saw something that you had and they needed to get closer to you to get it. And I'm like, so this could be somebody where they're trying to take something from you, like stealing something from you could be as far as that. And they're trying to pretend like something that they took from you was theirs, you know. But for some of y'all here, this could just be somebody where they're trying to take some type of idea from you. Somebody's trying to take something from you guys. And how they're trying to do it is by coming off caring to you. But they have some type of motive here. A lot of you guys here, this person see that you have a lot going for yourself. Or you just have like a lot of different opportunities. Um, For some of y'all, I don't know why I'm getting... um. Sapphire off of Bad Girls Club where like her and Suki supposed to be best friends they supposed to be friends and stuff like that and close or, or like rolling ET they're supposed to be cool with each other but the person kind of like disappear and stuff like that when you need them the most I don't know that's what I'm kind of getting them like or, or stuff like that like this is somebody where like they're not really they're very but Roly was using ET because ET was like having all the moments and then you know sapphire is using suki and stuff like that be, to get closer to them that's like what i've seen here so i don't know like somebody's trying to do something to get close closer to an opportunity like this can even be like an opportunity that's given to you and then somebody trying to um get closer to you to get their way in the door just to take like take over the opportunity i don't know that's what i'm getting here like somebody is trying to get somebody older person somebody to get to something they got to get close to you they got to get through you first that's what I get. Some of y'all know why I'm hearing this person can have chapped lips for some. Like really bad chapped lips where they could just have dry lips all the time. Cause I'm I I instantly got like that SpongeBob episode where like you gotta get through me first on that SpongeBob episode and the blow dryer and he blew blow dries her lips or her lips fell. That's what I'm getting. Like <laughs> Okay, so we have a three of cups to reverse. Yeah, some of y'all, this is definitely some type of friend here. So there's three of cups in reverse here. Or this is like an associate here for some. For some of y'all here, this could even be somebody where like somebody trying to get close to your business here as well for some. Like get close to your like your information, like you know, the gossiping, you know, with what you got going on and stuff like that. We got the justice here. So for some of y'all, whatever this person is trying to take it won't work out but somebody's trying to get closer and somebody it could even be like a new friend for some like this could be somebody i don't know but this is like somebody because i don't know for some for something makes me feel like this is not somebody that's like a long term like this is giving me like somebody new like somebody could be trying to come into your life or something like that here they're trying to get closer to you but they're trying to like be nice and stuff like that and giving you the um oh for some of y'all you know what i got i got the jesse Wu and tamar situation some of this could even be in a work environment and i don't even see no work cars like any pinnacles for some of y'all this could be like a co-worker where like somebody is trying to get closer to you and stuff like that so they could take your position that's what I'm getting. I'm getting because if y'all know about the Tamar and Jesse Wu situation, y'all know. If you know, you know. If you don't know, I'm going to sum it up. Basically, Jesse Wu was trying to, she was cool with Tamar. She got a little gossip on Tamar and she kind of took it back and stuff like that and made it public. It was like, she made it public and stuff like that to make it seem like Tamar was being messy at the workplace. To basically trying to get her fired, you know, and she basically insinuated, I would never do that at my workplace, but she basically, she, she put in the situation, she, you know, so if you know about the situation, you know about the situation, it's almost somebody kind of like setting you up, you think y'all cool, but they're really trying to get cool to you to get information on you so they can use it against you so they can take something from you, that's what I'm getting, so for some of y'all, be mindful here. I tell y'all stuff too, because somebody could be trying to get information on you at like a workplace. Some of y'all not aware. I'm not. I don't see any pinnacles, but I keep getting that Jesse Jesse Wu and Tamar situation where like somebody trying to get close to you because you have the opportunity or you have some type of ideas. You have something that they want, and they're going to try to. They're just being manipulated. They're going to try to get you to gossip. Or they're going to try to do something so they can get your position. That's what I'm seeing here. So, yeah. 
But for some of y'all, something is not going to work out with this Ten of Wands. Because something's going to still work out for you. Somebody's going to be burdened that something that they did didn't work. And they're still going to feel unfulfilled. So, yeah, that's what I'm seeing here, y'all. So, we're going to end it here, Pile 1. But this is what you need to know. Bye. That is up, y'all. So, Pile 2. Y'all song is Beyonce Formation. Um, This is going to be what you need to know. So, I got so much stuff that just came up instantly. Some of y'all, there's a lot of gossip going on about y'all right now. Some of you guys just gossip about what you're mixed with. People are trying to decide what you're mixed with or what's your culture, what's your heritage, you know, stuff like that. Um, There's gossip about your connection, you know. Some of you guys are just a relationship that you guys are in for some. Um, There's a really healthy connection for some. And people are kind of jealous of that that's coming up. Um, Others of you guys here, there's a lot of talk about... You know, you put this stuff into place. I mean, you know, with the song and just information in general, that was really Beyonce coming out telling them to step in line, know your place. So for some of y'all, people are kind of knowing their place or, or whatever. Like you putting people in their place without putting people in their place. There's just so much going on. We're going to get into all of that, but there's definitely a lot of gossip on you guys here. A lot of you guys are some uh, gossip on the stuff that you wear, the way that you dress. Like there's... There's a lot. Okay, so let's get into these messages, okay? I do have some of my Oracle cards are going to be using along with the new deck as well. But we're also going to pull and get some tarot right now just to get into the situation. So let's see. What is the situation about? I just want to know where all this is coming from. We got the death card. So if you have ended stuff. This could be people that you ended with, people that you no longer talk to anymore. You have changed then since these people have saw you, whoever these individuals are. Since they saw you, a lot has changed. For some of you, this could have been people that thought you were going to run back to them or come back to them and stuff like that. Like, these could have been people that thought you were going to come back and, like, I don't know, maybe, like, you want to stop being friends with them or you want to cut them off. I'm getting that as well. But this is a lot of walking away a lot of things changing a lot of endings these are people that's no longer in your life they're no longer around so people are talking about you because you have walked away we got the ace of pentacles dang pile two this how y'all coming in so people the reason why people are gossiping about you is because for some of y'all you ended something and it seemed like when you ended it you still had resources like let's say you you know lose a job you still got money you know that's what i'm getting here but for some of y'all this is even like you guys walk away from people and you you get coming into somebody that's what i'm getting here this ace of pentacles some of you guys there could be a lot of gossip that maybe you ended something with a person and then you end up getting an opportunity after that i'm getting that um that thing where like that guy was married to that lady and like i think it's like an nfl or basketball he was in something and they held off on giving him his promotion or this big lump sum of money they held off and waited after his divorce so for some of y'all it could even be where maybe it don't even have to be something like that it could be that but it don't even have to be something like that it could talk about y'all being out of relationship a little bit like you know because that came up in pile one some of y'all go watch pile one there may be a situation where you walked away from somebody end up getting money afterwards some of y'all you could have left a job got a better position got money afterwards some of y'all you stopped dealing with people and they thought you're going to come back to them and the whole time you ran into some dough you know what i'm saying that that's what i'm getting here with the page of wands in reverse a lot of people are upset there's a lot of people gossiping about you they're upset you have a lot of people wanting to apologize to you for how they treated you how they made you feel here these are people that you definitely cut off these are people that you definitely distance yourself from with this hermit card in reverse with this ace of swords these people see that whatever ideas that you had it's working out for you whatever plans that you wanted to do that you say you're gonna do is working out for you what it's basically stuff that you said that you're gonna do working out for you you. you know since you walked away from people with this queen of cups a lot of you guys you haven't really shown a lot of self-love to yourself a lot of emotion a lot of you guys you're more confident um a lot of you guys you are getting a lot of compliments with this ace of swords there's ever since you walked away from somebody you getting a lot of compliments from people it's it's just like people just kind of be like what the is this like i'm here if two plus two we can spell and five plus five is ten what the is this okay that's how people are feeling like and it's people that y'all let go of. Look at that. The four pinnacles in reverse. These are people that you held on to. This is why they're upset. These individuals are upset because, again, I told y'all in the very beginning, they thought you were going to come back. And I see why. These are people that you was 
neck to neck where y'all was cool you had a close bond you seen them they seen you you jump in they jump out you know it was like you know y'all was close you know these are people that y'all definitely had connections with if this was a relationship y'all was like two peas in a pie if this was a connection with just people friends family whatever co-workers whatever y'all was like motherfucking neck bones neck to neck right now it's like you let go of these people they thought they're always going to be in your life you kind of change for some of y'all don't even have to be that deep for some of y'all it could even talk about people kind of being slighted by the fact that you guys didn't end it don't even have to be it could feel like it ended for some of y'all maybe you didn't even end stuff with people for some it could just be you distance yourself away you started focusing on the things that you wanted to focus on the ideas that you had is coming through things is working out with this death card here a lot of you guys there could have been some type of change um and weight some of you guys you could have gained weight some of you guys you could have lost weight um but some of y'all there's some type of change somebody feel like you're getting more compliments than what you usually did like there could be people people feel like you're more prettier than what you used to be i'm just you know people could and it's not that you weren't pretty before or you weren't hasn't before it's like this person look good but they look even more good so there could be gossip on that where people kind of feel like there's something about you and it's a lot of you guys you have been giving a lot of love to yourself you know versus you know what what you look like versus when you ain't had no sleep versus when you had some sleep and some water y'all know what it looked like okay you know what i'm saying we all been here so that's what i'm saying like people kind of just feel like you're refreshed you blooming you get a lot of compliments you people feel like you just switched up people feel like you're kind of feeling yourself i'm feeling myself i'm feeling myself i'm feeling my okay i was wanted to do a whole little rodeo with my arm and like hey you know so y'all are like really a vibe right now with this knight of wands reverse you got people that played you that feel bad and regretting it with the two of cups they wish they would have offered you the relationship here they wish they would have appreciated you they wish they would have gave more to you with the six of pentacles here they wish they could balance something out here with this queen of wands where they feel like that i'm hearing xex of pillars on 10 right now and with the eight of swords somebody feels stuck Business eight of pentacles here in reverse. Somebody don't feel good en good enough. Y'all got people that played y'all in the past that now don't feel good enough for you right now. That's what I'm getting here. So there's a lot of gossip going on. I may do a, a reading on what's the gossip, you know, because you know, but because y'all power one was like a storyline. Y'all is more so like everything. Everybody here, everybody there, everybody around the corner. It's 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 like a whole entourage. Okay, this is what this is giving. So there's a lot of gossip on y'all. There's a lot of talk. A lot of people sipping your tea, whether it's peppermint, black tea, camomile com tea, whatever. It's the people is sipping green tea, okay? Yo, G T. People is drinking the tea, okay? So that's what y'all need to know, Power One. Um, with this Nine of Cups in reverse here, some of you guys here, I, I, I don't even know what this is yet, cause you know I I wanted to say what I wanted to say, but we we just go wait. We got the King of Cups here, so some of you guys here, somebody. With this King of Cups in reverse and this King of Cups here, I mean, not the Cups in reverse, somebody definitely was, somebody could have thought somebody was mature, but they was being manipulated. That's what I'm seeing here. Like, somebody, I don't know what this is. Like, somebody could have, and this is definitely some type of water sign. It don't have to be. But this is definitely making me feel like somebody that's older. So they're supposed to be mostly intelligent, but they're kind of, like, this could even be somebody. I don't know why I'm getting somebody older. Like, we got the two of wands here. This can even be a situation for some of you guys where, like, somebody was causing some type of illusions here. Somebody, or this could be somebody wasn't seeing something that was in an illusion or that was causing an illusion here. With the king of cups here, somebody could have acted emotionally available here. With the two of wands here, this could even be somebody that th had you thinking that something was going to be something, or this could even be somebody that had a choice of what path they wanted to go down here, you know? Let's see. We got the eight of swords here. Look at that. So, some of you guys, somebody was manipulating somebody, had somebody all up in their head and stuff, you know, had somebody feeling stuck. With this Knight of Pentacles here, in this sun card reverse so this could even be a situation where somebody could have felt stuck financially somebody could have felt stuck financially like with the ace of swords somebody wasn't stuck but they was stuck because they was dealing with somebody financially with the sun card reverse things could have started off going good you have the two of wands here um this is a choice here 
So for some of y'all, and this came out in Power One as well. Some of y'all go watch, you know, watch Power One. Maybe some extra messages in it for some of y'all. Where you know, but for some of y'all, what you need to know is the King of Cups here makes me feel like this was y'all, where y'all had emotion for someone. Y'all was mature, emotionally intelligent, emotionally available. That's what I'm getting here. Which is to a wine where somebody could have made a decision to go towards somebody else that was causing some type of illusions playing games. Now somebody feels stuck because they could have been with somebody for fighting. Now I'm not getting it was with somebody for financial reasons, but they got with someone that could have had finances. This person was, you know, playing games with them and now somebody could be stuck. They're not stuck, but they're stuck. And with the sun card reverse, things were going good at first. So somebody could have made a decision to choose. Somebody could, it don't even have to be somebody walked away from y'all. Somebody could have chosen the person over you because of financial. Like this could be like somebody having options. They trying to figure out who they go date. They chose to date somebody else because they had more going on for themselves. And that was, and stuff like that. Now I'm not saying that God with this person from resource because I'm not necessarily getting that. I am seeing we do got some type of cups out here. We got a couple swords, you know, we got some, it was passion. Somebody dated somebody because it was passion. They had things. It was in a good place. I'm not getting anything negative from it, but somebody definitely got played. You was being, you would, could, and this could even be a situation where you would be like emotionally available. Like somebody could have, I don't know why I'm getting somebody chose somebody that maybe was nonchalant. Like, I don't know why I'm getting passion, like. It's almost like one person being emotionally available, maybe give the compliments, you know, maybe open. You can tell that they're interested. Maybe the other person, it's like a flight. It's like a chase. Like, yeah, so some of y'all, maybe you, for some of y'all, you was being emotionally available with somebody. That's what the is with this King of Cups. Y'all, okay, okay, okay. We get it here, pile two. We get it here. We get in here, and you see how long it's taken me to kind of get to the plot of what this is? That's because this is how it feels, where it's like somebody went through something, and they kind of felt like it took so long to get here, and now I'm seeing what it is. This is the plot. Like, really? So, y'all, it's emotionally available for somebody. They could have chose somebody else over you for, like, a chase. Like, they felt somebody else. Did somebody chase another person that didn't really want them? And this could be, it could even be the other way around. It could be, it could be the other way around for some of y'all where financially, for financial reasons, maybe this person had money and then maybe they got with someone that didn't have it. Now they're stuck, but they're not stuck. Almost like we, 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 um, we put up with one another, but I really don't want to be here. Things did work out. We were going good and begin. That's what I'm getting here. I'm just seeing where somebody could have chosen another person over you guys, and you guys were emotionally available, open to somebody, and they chose someone else over because they felt like they were like a chase, or they felt like they had something more, or something like that here. And they could have did it based on passion or whatever the case may be. Now somebody stuck, but not stuck. Like they're stuck because they can't walk away for, due to financial reasons, or they can't walk away due to even if they're the ones with the finances, they still can't walk away because they they stuck with somebody. It's like people have to put up with one another because of the resources. But neither one of them is stuck. That's what I'm getting here, you know? And with this death card here, something is starting to end. Whatever the, whatever that was, is starting to no longer work. If two people were coexisting, but they don't want to coexist, it's starting to not work. It's starting to crumble here with this death card. It could even already end it. But some of y'all, something has ended between you and this person here. So now this person, look at that. We got the higher pay. Somebody felt like they didn't use the intuition. So somebody, something ended with you. So somebody, somebody felt like you're the one that got away or they felt like you're the one. That's what you need to know. Like somebody felt like, this is like somebody having options and they chose the wrong one. Now they kind of want to go choose the other one because they found out this one was not the right one. The other one was the right one. I don't know why I keep getting that cup. Tell me how you could have played that when you were younger. Like you put something in a cup and you move it around and stuff like that. And then you got to guess what's under the cup. I don't know why I'm getting that. I don't know what that game is called. Some of y'all, you could have did it for money. You could have made bank. Like I'm getting that. Some of y'all, you could have did that. You used to make money. I used to get stuff back then for being so cold at it. I don't know why I'm getting that. My heater just failed. So... Yes, you see my heater just fail, y'all. Like something's falling apart here. I'm looking at the four pentacles in reverse. This is my that y'all let go. And some of y'all you could even not want to let go of this person with the four pentacles. The four pentacles is talking about possession, you know. It's like I'm letting go of something I, I usually would have never let go of before or I would have held on to before, right? That's what I'm getting. So this is somebody that y'all held on to before. Or you didn't want to let this person go, but you let them go. So that's what I'm saying. That's what y'all need to know. Somebody something's not working out for somebody 
and they stuck in something, all right? But we're going to be moving on. That's what y'all need to know. So let's get into these cards. I chose to do y'all my cards, my deck. You switch it up for power one and power two. So we got natural body self. Five, okay, you know, I ain't trying to, you know, you two, you know how they be. But a lot of you guys here, there's, again, people are talking about how you look. People are definitely talking about your body. Some of you guys, you could have been losing weight or gaining weight. There's definitely some type of talk about your um body here. People find you to be very attractive here. Let's see what's going on with this. We got the high priestess in reverse here. Okay. Okay. I don't know what I want to hear what to say. Like, okay. Like, like it's like a petty okay where like somebody say something to you. Like, okay. And like, okay. And like, I don't know. Like, that's how it came out. We have the six of wands reverse. So some of you, oh, for some of y'all, did y'all lose weight or gain weight? And now somebody from the past trying to creep back up. This is what this is giving up the six of wands reverse. So some of y'all, somebody thought they were using the intuition. Like some of you guys, somebody, um, somebody in the past could have made y'all feel second. This could be a Sagittarius, could be a Leo. Somebody from the past could have made y'all feel like y'all weren't that girl with a guy. You know, that's what I'm seeing here. Like somebody could have took advantage of you. Maybe for some of you guys, somebody knew you had insecurities. They kind of took advantage of the insecurities and stuff like this. Is like somebody seeing you lose weight or gain weight after you know trying to pick out your insecurities. Some of you don't even have to be somebody that you dated here. We got the six of cups in reverse. Yeah. Oh. We got the Ten of Wands. Oh, baby. This doesn't even have to be... Some of y'all, this could be a relationship or some of y'all, this is not giving a relationship. This is giving, like, people around you. Could be friends, family, co-workers, or people that you once knew. This is giving, like... With the Six of Wands reverse and it's high priest, I'm getting so many messages. For some of y'all, let's say... People are kind of used to you not being as confident. Maybe you know you probably had certain weight, you know, you gained weight, you lost weight, whatever, right? You probably didn't have some type of confidence for some of you guys where you kind of not even confident, you just probably didn't feel, you know. I don't know about y'all. When I sit down, sometimes I hide my stomach. I be putting my hand in front of my stomach. I don't care. It is what it is. Yes, you're not about to have me on care my stomach showing. No, you're not. Okay. Yes, my hand is right here, is that. You know what I'm saying? Even I do that sometimes. So it's like everybody got certain stuff that they're insecure, right? They could be something where people kind of knew you was insecure of certain stuff. And they kind of weren't used to you being in the front. And some of you guys are starting to be like, now you're in the front. With this high priestess in reverse, it could even talk about people taking advantage of you where it's like they manipulating you, taking advantage of you because they know you have certain insecurities. And now you're kind of losing weight or gaining weight. And now the insecurity that you used to have is starting to kind of fall off you know things are starting to change starting to become more confident now these people are starting to become burdened because it's like you're like in the front you know you're like the face of a magazine like that's what it's given so there could be certain people that's not used to you getting as much as and i told y'all a lot of you guys are getting more compliments there are people that's upset about you getting more compliments or something because maybe you guys didn't get approached as much maybe you guys didn't get as much of compliments this is like people that know you. That this is people that's been around you long enough to know how you're approached, how you're not approached. They ain't been around you enough to see how people interact with you. You know, so this is somebody that definitely knows. Like they starting to see certain stuff different here. You know, and they're kind of being burdened by that. You know, so that's what I'm seeing here. You know, you got certain people that's burdened by the extra attention that you guys are getting now. You know, they're not used to you being the face of the front. The others of you guys are just definitely somebody that could have not used the intuition, the path that could have manipulated you, made you feel like you weren't good enough, made you feel second. This could have been somebody that compared you to other people. They were like comparing you to other people for some. Or this is somebody that um you you felt like they wanted other stuff. Because I'm looking at this horse. You see how like the horse kind of looking back to the side and this person looking forward. It's like this person where like they still got a wandering eye. So you could have dealt with somebody that had like a wandering eye or they compared you to other people or the things that they praise and desire you may not have had. Like you didn't have them things like, oh, I love this with long hair or a big bud, you know, all types of stuff. And maybe you did not have certain stuff or look like this. You know, that's what I'm getting here. Somebody here, you let this person go and now they burden because they see how you look. I don't know why I'm getting that. Um, 
that you know how like celebrities be big or whatever and then they was with someone and they know the person that they was with treated them poorly due to how due to their weight and then that person lose weight and then they be like i know that person wish they would have treated them better now nah, you ever see that this is like y'all were like y'all gained or lost some type of weight and people could and this is not and for some of y'all like this is giving like a group of people where like on one end, you have people that's not really happy about the extra attention you're getting. And then on the other end, you have people that knew somebody that you dated. They knew how this person treated you. It's like somebody that you dated, their friends, their people seeing you and see you lose weight and gain weight, whatever, right? They like, you know, it's almost like a, they, and it's not, it's like I'm not saying it out loud, but I'm thinking it where it's like, Paul, too, dated my sister cousin brother auntie c uncle right or dated somebody the person the my person my people treated them poorly and i ain't gonna care pal too they didn't they sh they sh they sh and on my on my people that's kind of what it's given it's almost like people hate to admit it where it's like you even have exes or people that y'all dated people's like friends their families even thinking that they kind of play themselves and it's not something that's being said out loud but it's like dang you really played yourself because Paul two done lost and gained weight and they looking good and you ain't even with them now. Nah. Like you're not with Paul two no more. You should have stayed with, and, and it's like almost and then it's on top of y'all having a personality. It's like you should have stayed with Paul two because not only they got the personality, they got the looks, the skills. It's it's kind of like a reevaluation. You even have certain people that kind of even want to say it because it's like I'm, I'm on your side, but I have to admit, Paul two the upgraded on you. Like maybe you have um past people that you dated or messed around with people that know you like their friends or family that know you yes they feel like you are you are team on their on their family member whoever they close to that's supposed to have a bet they they have to admit you, you had an upgrade all right but that's what i'm seeing here we got doing the same from years ago doing it. so some of y'all what you um need to know for some of you guys is you or somebody is in the same place doing the same stuff and that don't have to be a bad thing when you in the same place those that's not a bad thing but somebody has not elevated they could be with the same mindset doing the same thing it's kind of somebody stuck in kind of like a cycle here and you guys got some new stuff going on for yourself we got the king of wands here so a lot of you guys you are in some type of a lot of you guys you are independent here with this eight of swords here, somebody feels somebody does not know how to feel like some of you guys maybe you're independent or maybe you're like a boss or you're in charge or you're like some type of leader here or a lot of you guys you can just be very independent here and with the eight of swords here somebody is stuck here like somebody just keep it being you at one point in time where like you were stuck in a situation that you didn't know how you're gonna get out of now you in a different situation now with the moon card here we got, I don't know why I'm getting hidden attention, secrets here. We got the two of wands here. Yeah, so with some of you guys here, this is giving like you guys being, like, it's, it's giving like you guys going towards a path. You're going towards a different path here. Somebody here is stuck here with some secrets, some lies, you know, and you move forward. So, yeah, that's what I'm getting here. Like, a lot of you guys, this is a situation where, like, some you decided to go towards a different direction here because somebody was being manipulated. They was keeping secrets. They was lying. This is somebody that, you know, you felt stuck. You felt like you felt like you was in something that you didn't need to be in. And with this King of Wands here, a lot of you guys, you could even gain your independence. It's almost like y'all walked away. You gained your independence. Some with the moon card, somebody was keeping things hidden from you. For a lot of you guys here some of y'all here it can even be somebody feeling stuck because they want to go towards a different direction but they can't here with the moon card here there could be some type of secrets here or something's being hidden here with this king of wands here somebody can want to be on their own we got the hangman in reverse somebody's unhappy for sure so this can even be somebody who's keeping something hidden because they knew it would hurt another person here or somebody was keeping hidden that they weren't happy. Like somebody was keeping it hidden that they really weren't happy. They kind of felt stuck in something. They really wanted to go towards a new direction. That's what I'm getting here. So somebody, somebody could be still stuck in this situation. That's what I'm seeing here. So for, but yeah, so for some of y'all, somebody's stuck in the same situation. Like it's almost like you, so some of y'all like wherever you left somebody at, they still in the same situation doing the same stuff. 
So like, and this could have been somebody that like you like I, everybody been there. I don't care what nobody say like, hey, you ever been with somebody and it's like you 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 kind of fuck like you missing out or whatever. Where it's like, it's almost like I didn't miss out on nothing. That's kind of what I'm getting here. So for some of y'all, what you need to know is some of there could have been somebody that you could have fuck like you you um like if you walked away from somebody you fuck like you were missing out or I don't know. It's just something here where you guys felt like that and you somebody doing the same stuff. Like, somebody's doing the same. They still got secrets. They still keeping things hidden. Somebody still want to go down a different direction, but they're still not because they're still letting certain stuff keep them stuck. Uh, I don't know how this work obtains to y'all. With this Eight of Pinnacle here in reverse, this could be somebody that's doing something for work that they really don't want to do. With this Nine of Cups in reverse, somebody's really not happy here. It's some type of partnership here with the Two of Cups. There's a lot of fighting. There's a lot of arguments. Somebody wants to go down a different direction here. They stuck. Some of this is a relationship. We got the page of swords. So y'all watching you with the page of pentacles here that didn't appreciate you. Why y'all move forward and get more dough and balance your life out? Why they ain't something toxic? Some of y'all, you have somebody that's obsessed with you and they're watch, watching you. Oh my God, I said watching you, Lord. They're watching you for some. Um, For some of y'all here, there is a person that's in an unhappy relationship they don't want to be in it anymore but they're stuck with someone um this is somebody that's obsessed with you they're watching you this is somebody that did not appreciate you guys you move forward ever since you move forward you didn't have gains more you didn't, you got more money something that worked out for you your life is balancing out somebody is somebody's doing the same somebody still so some of y'all you're dealing with someone and they was dealing with someone else or they was in some type of situation. They're still in that situation. That's that's just what's coming up. That's what y'all need to know. They're still in that situation. And they're seeing... This is somebody that stayed. So some of y'all could be like somebody that stayed in, in a situation. That like some Like this could be somebody that stayed. I don't know. This, I don't know what this is. But somebody stayed in the, with somebody. And with this, with all these pinnacles here, this could have been like a past lover. Like a long-term relationship. This is because all these pinnacles. Um... Like, somebody could have stayed with someone because they had history. Or history was there, so they stayed. But this is somebody that watching you. That's what I'm seeing here. Why is this person watching my power too? We got the judgment on her here. Because this is somebody that's having a lot of evaluation. This person's seen a lot of stuff that they did not see before. This person could even be waking up having like an awaken with this four swords of reverse here this is somebody that kind of seen you kind of this is like somebody kind of and this somebody that didn't appreciate you so this could be like somebody seeing you kind of walk away get your life together things working out for you they still in the same situation still getting taken advantage of um with the seven of cups here you got different opportunities different things happening in your life so i don't know like Basically, somebody's in the same situation and watching you. Like, they're in the same situation dealing with the same person. You're just, that's what I'm seeing here. So, they're watching you because they felt they could have had much more, you know? That's what I'm seeing here. So, text resonate, leave a dozen on that. We're going to leave that out there. Okay, we have walked away for good. Yeah, y'all walked away for good. Some of y'all here, this is somebody that never walked away from somebody for good here as well. We got put you in a third party. So this person could have put you on the third party or you were the third party for some. Uh, we got, so people are talking about how attractive you are. People are saying that you are bad, you're handsome, you're fine. People are talking about your looks. I got that in the very beginning. We got the emperor here. If you're a man, People are talking about how attractive you are, how you look very strong, how you got this daddy energy. When you walk into the room, you look good. People can even talk about how good you smell. They definitely like the way that you dress. Um, They love your demeanor. They just love how you carry yourself. If you're a woman here, there could be um people that talk about how attractive you are. You keep up with yourself. A lot of you guys here, you could, um, I'm here, I, I just want somebody, body. They treat me like somebody. Body. I'm getting that song here. Like for some of y'all, there could be people that like you because some of y'all you could sing. Um, uh, for some of you guys here, you could dress really good as well. A lot of you guys, you can also be somebody where you kind of know you you don't need people. You want people. So that's another thing that's making you very attractive. Because people feel like um you you like this. People feel like you're a bad. You got like this. Some of y'all could be like a career. You got your own career, on money, resources, or you got a nice bag for yourself. You look good, handsome, beauty on ten. 
pretty. You know what I'm saying? I'm hearing, I don't know, I'm hearing um, JT. Uh, you want, I'm hearing he want to be from the city. P good. You know, boobies pretty. You know what I'm saying? So this is somebody that, some of y'all here, people can feel like you, like, people can feel like you, like, Oh, let me not say y'all. This ain't supposed to be 18 plus. I ain't even, I'm just hold. I'm gonna just hold my thoughts because this ain't supposed to be 18 plus. But I'm telling y'all about that. Well, any, I'm gonna just say it anyway. People can fuck it's pretty. Like for some of y'all, I don't know why I'm getting like y'all. I'm trying to tell y'all these messages be coming up. But people can fuck it's pretty. People can be talking about like you know y'all areas. Like yeah, or especially for some of you guys, like it's like people seeing you in the bathing suit, especially or something like that. And you know they see them they're like man, damn. That's what it's giving, okay? We got the three of wands here. A lot of you guys say you could be traveling a lot as well, or you're traveling more. Some of you guys you could be planning to travel here as well. Some of you guys you could be in a position to plan to travel. With this sun card in reverse here, for some of you guys, oh, we got the six of pentacles here. For some of you guys here as well, there could be somebody that wants to come towards you. Y'all got people that want to apologize to you. You got people that are trying to come towards y'all. With this emperor here, for some of y'all, there could be people that watch him here. And look, you look, but you can't touch. Like, there's people that's watching from the far. And these could be people that's conceited. Like, some of y'all, you got... So, yeah, there's somebody around you that want to approach you. It's definitely a fire sign. Um, There's somebody around you that want to approach you. They find you be extremely attractive. This is somebody that's a very attractive themselves. They could be very confident, but there's something about you that makes this person feel not confident. Like, they can kind of feel... Like, this is, like, two attractive people, but one of them feel like the other's out of their league. Like, two people attracted, they both find each other attractive, they both look attractive, or they both will be attracted to each other, but somebody thinks that the other person's out of their league, so they don't see it. That's what I'm getting here. Like, somebody, they look just as good, but they feel like you out of their league. Somebody don't know if they can bag you or not, or pull you. Yeah, we got the four cuts in reverse. So, I mean, I said the person could have the opportunity and they missed the opportunity here. That's what the sun card could be in reverse. But, like, somebody's upset with themselves because they kind of had the opportunity and they missed it. Now, something that fell apart here. So, y'all could definitely have some type of fire sign or water sign here that has some type of emotions for you here. This might somebody that feels like something fell apart, you know. Maybe they had the opportunity and that could would have fell apart. Or this could just be somebody where things started going good with you and this person and things could have... They could have had the opportunity to take it further or something. Maybe they didn't. I don't know. That's what I've seen here. But, yeah, somebody finds you to be attractive and they want to approach you. Okay, we got enemies watching you shine. Be blessed. We also got flex and don't really have it. So, for some of y'all, there, there was people... I don't, there, some of y'all, there's something that you have that people pretend that they have, but they don't. Like, this could be people flexing something that you really have. Like, this can be talk about people flexing a lifestyle that you really live. I don't know why I'm getting that as well. We got the Queen of Cups here. A lot of you guys here, a lot of things are starting to work out for you. A lot of dreams, a lot of things that you wanted for yourself. A lot of things that you put a lot of hard work into. A lot of things that you care about deeply, like your pages and stuff like that. I see this is working out for you here. We got the Knight of Wands reverse. These could be people that's like very, um, I don't know why I'm getting flamboyant here. We got the Justice card reverse. Yeah, so some of you, there could be people that kind of felt like they were better than you because they, I'm here flexing but really don't have it. That's what I'm getting here. Like some of y'all, and this came out in another reading like a while back with the Justice card reverse and the Ace of Swords. Oh my God, look at that, the Page of Pentacles. Like for some of y'all, with this Ace of Swords and Page of Pentacles, for some of y'all, there could be people that's finding out about somebody flexing. Like this could talk about like somebody like living a lifestyle portraying themselves to live a lifestyle that they don't live and people are kind of calling them out for like oh you fake this and this and that like i don't know why i'm getting this situation where it's like somebody flexing and then they talking ish about you while they're flexing or they paid all their money to get something but they really don't have any money they just look like they got it and with this age of swords, people are calling somebody out on that. And this could have been somebody that could have talked about you guys or could have treated you poorly. So somebody that treated you poorly because they thought they had more than you or better than you, they was actually faking. Like, they even they either had stuff, but they was broke, or they were, was buying fake stuff. And people are catching on, like, oh, you really don't got money. You just somebody that's spending all your money to look like you got money, but you really ain't got no money. Or it's something like this here. Somebody could have treated you poorly. It was overly confident, thinking it was this and that, thinking it was this girl or this hot-ish, this guy or whatever. 
talking about y'all and the whole time people are finding out about that and then for some of you guys here this could be somebody where they this could be some of you could have had emotions for somebody like this where you could have had emotions for somebody that was cocky you know somebody that treated you m mistreated you here with this ace of swords here, this person could have got like a lot of compliments and stuff like that but the page of pinnacle said like this is like somebody that would get a lot of compliments and stuff like that off of something that's really not real like somebody fake flexing they spent all they check to look like they got something they get a compliments so they start feeling themselves and thinking they better than you but it's all an illusion that's what i'm getting here like somebody did that and whoever this person is there's something that they used to do that you have now it's almost like somebody treating you poorly fake flexing now you the one who actually really have it that's what i'm getting here so that's what y'all need to know like there's somebody that's definitely look at that we have the strength card in reverse now somebody feel out there somebody feels exposed they feel vulnerable here we got the four wands for some of y'all this is somebody that y'all was in a relationship with for some of y'all this is not a relationship this could be a family member here and this is not a family member this is a uh, somebody y'all was in a relationship with with the six of pentacles here for some of y'all here this could even be somebody that could have got into a relationship with someone a person that got into it with can't do for them as much i'm here when a nigga won't you won't you baby and you can't do nothing for you that's how i'm here y'all um yeah i'm also seeing um page of cups here we also got the three cups some of y'all this could be a friends as well or a friend group so i'm getting monthly messages some of y'all there's a this is even a lover a family member or like a friend group where somebody was fake flexing like they had all the items but it was fake or they had the um they spent all their money to look if they had something and they started to build their self-esteem up more they started getting compliments and this person is really a page we don't have no queens no kings we only got the queen of cups but we don't have like we don't have nothing out here that's like S -s sustainable nothing out here and with this page of pinnacles here this is somebody that really was a page but they pretended to act like they were something that they weren't they started to fill themselves if you was in a relationship with this person this person could have started to treat you like you were less than them like you weren't as valuable anymore like when they first got you yeah but now that i'm i got this and this going on you're not as valuable as i thought you were that's what i'm getting here some of y'all here this can even be friends where his friends started getting attention or whatever they started having certain stuff and they like this can be like i don't know why i'm getting um like you know how like the friend groups where it's like aesthetic friends where it's like you know we pretended to have an aesthetic or live a certain aesthetic lifestyle and then you're not you just living in your truth and you don't fit in with us that's what i'm getting here where something like that but like let's say everybody else got like cardinals and you just got like a regular car it could be where it's like you are the same as them but because they look a certain way and they appear to others that they look a certain way they kind of pushed y'all out or you know that's what i'm getting here there's something like that where people kind of try to and it's i'm getting it's more than one person i mean it could have been a lover or like some type of family member or like some type of friend group where they try to like they have it looked that way y'all both live in the same lifestyle it's just they're appearing to look a different one so we're gonna leave it at that y'all but this is what y'all need to know babies until next time bye